WRTV Streaming News is sponsored by Tom Wood Group. I'm Nicole Griffin bringing you the latest WRTV headlines. It's been a violent start of the month for Indianapolis teens. At least five kids under 18 have been shot and killed this month. So far this year, 25 people under the age of 18 have been the victims of homicides. The most recent was 14 year old Kaylea Dean, who was shot and killed near 32nd and Emerson on Indy's East Side Thursday. The Department of Justice is working to crack down on this violence. The U.S. District Attorney of Southern Indiana says the Department of Justice's Project Safe Neighborhood is trying to stop crime before it happens, knowing that firearms are winding up in the hands of those who shouldn't have them. We've seen that so many of the shootings and killings that we're seeing, you know, are in, in our district are being carried out by people who under the law should have never had the gun in the first place. The Department of Justice has invited federal and local law enforcement from across the country to Indianapolis. The Violent Crime Reduction Summit starts on December 11th. A day filled with celebration at the Marion County Courthouse. 32 children were officially adopted. The hallways were lined with balloons and streamers and cupcakes were served. It was a day that many of the kids waited years for. Family and friends were there to witness it all. For the adoptive families, it was a day they finally feel complete. I'm going to get it up. I'm happy. I'm, I'm excited. I'm ecstatic. Uh, we finally made it here. <laughs> On top of the more than 200 Indiana children needing to be adopted, there are more than 13,000 in foster care right now. To learn more about how you can get involved, head to our website, WRTV.com.